one thing a hater is going to be is a hater. So a client of mine received bad news earlier today and it wasn't something that he wasn't warned about previously. What it was, was that this individual, he's doing love magic. He had a plethora of women throwing themselves at him at the job, but there was one female in particular I told him to stay away from her because that female will cost him his career. And that's exactly what happened. This guy couldn't see my logic. He put in his mind that I can't see her doing what she did. I'm at her house. I'm spending all his time with her. Shit happens. As they say, hell hath no fury like a woman scorned. See, this woman got jealous. He had intimate relations with her, which was against their job's policy. They call it fraternizing. She made it obvious that they had intimate dealings and that went against job policies. But she didn't care because she was previously looking for a new career. So he was supposed to be there as what he was. But she felt as though, well, I don't even care. I'm not going to be here anymore. So I'm going to make sure that he doesn't have nothing. Someone who was destined for greatness. He was supposed he was going to be promoted. Actually, he was promoted. And he was going to even he was going to be pushed even further. Because fucking hater it happens it happens to the best of us for example last year this fucking nut hugger by the name of King Brujo, kissing my ass. The guy was chasing me down for fucking years, trying to get a fucking interview for me, fucking in my inbox, trying to get me to train him or teach him. I'm not gonna post this fucking shit here because I don't need to. My word is solid as fucking stone, unlike this buster here. But as I was saying, this individual, was trying to imitate everything I did from robes that I would wear, from terminologies I would use, to cigars I would be smoking. They say imitation is a form of flattery. So me thinking that this was a solid dude, even when it led into disagreements and beefing i'm thinking this guy is gonna do some magic i'm expecting to see my life get fucked up i'm expecting to see something because all this brujo i'm this big bad ba bad guy or some shit like that nothing ever happened besides a guy hitting a report button on a video that i had which gave me a hint and it made me suspicious at that time suspicious of this individual whether or not he's the one who reported me or not it wasn't until a year later that i found out this was the guy who striked my my page a year before because when all of the reports came out all the strikes came out then they showed me who did it so i put past them that he would be a buster so as i said in the beginning a hater is going to be a hater. Now that we know this, let's look at me now. 
And you can take this example for yourself. Five months ago, I started TikTok. This guy, King Brujo, got up on his social media platform. Ha, 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 ha. Look at my spirit. Look, ha, 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 ha. Making it seem as though he did spiritual magic or something like that. And that's how I lost my page. Lo and behold, he reported my shit, my TikTok. Now, bear with me. My TikTok was at 14,000, 13, 14,000 followers. I started a TikTok five months ago. Now, that TikTok account has about 19,700 followers. I've been at least, I've been, excuse me, I've been viral at least four to five times already since i've been on tiktok and recently with a controversial uh video i recently dropped i've grew at least probably uh two th uh, what two three thousand subscribers already so now i say this what you have to do in a situation like this now that you've took in the fall you're going to have to go to the drawing board. You're going to have to reassess your situation and come back fucking determined and come back harder. That's what you're gonna to have to do. You can't fucking sit there and be like, oh my God, I fucked up my career. My career is fucking lost. You gotta do something. If you got money behind you, you better take that money and get back on your fucking feet. Don't stay in your bed fucking rolling around and, and sobbing like, oh my God, my life. Oh my God, fuck that. Look at my TikTok now. My TikTok. Look at my YouTube now. Fuck that. Let's get on the YouTube. There's people with the same amount of subscribers that I have that's been on YouTube for at least 10 fucking years. 10 fucking years. When my YouTube got shut down, what did I do? I got my ass up and went to fucking work. I didn't complain. I didn't ask for no fucking handouts. I went out and did what the fuck I got to do. In less than a fucking year, less than five months, I reached one million fucking views. One million. Production, productivity. One thing a fucking hater can't take from you is fucking talent. If you got it, you're always going to be on fire. They can do what they want to do. Look at Charleston White. Charleston White has been reported over and over and over. The guy comes up, he's fucking putting up numbers.